from the University of California at Davis. This is News Watch. Fifty years of pumping groundwater from the Consumnes River watershed has left this 20-mile stretch of the river dry during most of the summer. But the good news is that's going to change with the turning of a valve. With that turn, 40 cubic feet per second of water poured into a thirsty Consumnes River. From a conservationist perspective, this is momentous. This is addressing a real insidious problem that's been going on for decades. And it really represents a lot of institutional kind of collective thinking and agreement now, consensus about how to try and manage this problem. The drying of the riverbed has either delayed or eliminated the false salmon run on the Cosumnes, and it has affected many other animals and plants on the river. But as the groundwater level has gone down, the ability of the young trees to survive, the ability of this kind of forest to replace itself has diminished dramatically. UC Davis water scientists work with Sacramento County, farmers, and the Nature Conservancy to learn why the Cosumnes was going dry. This is an experiment, okay? Based, based on this flow, we'll be able to calibrate our groundwater model and use that model ba to basically predict how to operate this better in the future, because if we can turn this off and on, we can manage this with a lot of precision. This is the first experiment of its kind in California. This is priceless in terms of, uh, from a research perspective. We can't beat this. The effort will hopefully permanently improve the entire Cosumnes River corridor. Reporting from the Consumnes, I'm Paul Fotenow. For more information, please log on to broadcast.ucdavis.edu.